how to use buffer hi guys welcome back to another video and in this video i'm going to be telling you how you can use buffer to manage your social media accounts and grow your audience so having said that let's just jump into the video now i'm over here on their main website and just simply gonna go ahead and jump right into it and we're gonna go ahead and sign up so the sign up process is very simple all you gotta do is come over here and you will see the get started button over here so we just simply click on get started there is a pricing plan however let me just show you i'm gonna open it up in another tab and over here it's going to show us some of the pricing plans over here we have four pricing plans so this is billed annually meaning yearly so over here we have the free plan the essential the team and the agency right so for the free plan you only get the basic publishing tools and a landing page builder and for the essential ones it's going to be five dollars per month per social channel now what that means is how many social channels you add that is going to charge you five dollars per social channel so for example if you have like an instagram page and then a twitter page and a facebook page and a youtube channel that's like four channels right there so you multiply that with five that's twenty dollars over there per month so it's going to cost you twenty dollars to manage four channels keep that in mind same goes with the 10 so keep that in mind and then in the essential one you get the planning and publishing tool analytics tool engagement tools and a landing page builder so this is pretty decent and you know all the basic publishing tools and all the basic tools that you would need within buffer you get that in the essential ones as the name suggests which is a pretty decent uh you know name and then for the team one you get ten dollars per social channel per month and since it's billed annually it's going to cost you 120 dollars per year and instead of 144 i think uh, because it's billed annually i mean i think you're saving i think like 10 to 20 percent depending upon what type of plan you're using so keep that in mind and in this one you get essential features and plus features you get the unlimited team members and clients draft collaboration tools and easy clear exportable reports and then you have the agency which is a hundred dollars per month for 10 social media channels so keep that in mind for this one you have to have like i think 10 social media accounts otherwise it's not going to work but uh we're going to switch it over to monthly so over here as you can see and i'm going to go ahead and use the essential plan over here so i'm going to go ahead and try free for 14 days and i'm going to use a temporary email address over here to actually go ahead and sign in so i'm going to copy the email address over here and i'm going to go back over here enter in my email and then i'm just simply gonna sign up for free over here and we're gonna be good to go and over here this is how it looks like so welcome to buffer over here where would you like to start publishing analytics engagement or page or start page builder you can go ahead and skip this or choose whichever one you want i'm gonna go ahead and skip and i'm gonna quickly jump in and you know connect my accounts now you can connect them later as well so let's go ahead and do that and show you how you can connect more accounts later on so over here as you can see this is how it looks like so let me first um go ahead and confirm this verification email over here confirm email and then we enter in our password over here and then we click on confirm and we are good to go i believe let me actually sign in all right so now i have you know verified my account we are good to go so now let's go ahead and go ahead and click on add channels over here to get started so we're going to click on add channel and we're going to choose the channel that we want so let's go ahead and connect a facebook account so we're going to choose the facebook page and log in why all right so let's go ahead and start you know managing our channel so to add a channel simply come over here onto the left side and the corner you will see manage you will see add channels simply click on add channel it's going to open up this pop-up over here that's going to say you know connect the channel so we're going to choose instagram facebook twitter whichever one we want so let's go ahead and connect our instagram page for this one we have to authenticate with our facebook account i don't know why that is usually that doesn't happen i don't know why so if you don't have your instagram page connected with a facebook page then you're going to have to do that and then you're going to have to connect it with your with buffer or any other website that you're using to manage your social media so we're going to add that so there we go we have our page added now let's go ahead and connect another page i'm going to choose the facebook page over here choose the facebook page it's going to open up over here choose whatever page that you have click on add buffer there we go next you can add like a twitter page as well so I'll click on twitter and over here it's going to take a couple of seconds and boom there you go 
if you haven't uh, logged in with your twitter account then you will have to enter in your login details but pretty much that's it that's how you do it now let's go ahead and move back to the dashboard we're going to have some more options as well so over here once you have added all of your accounts so on the left side you will see all of your accounts and you can see your schedule posts so over here you can schedule posts by choosing the date and time or when to you want to schedule it you can go with weekly monthly or you can create a post itself by clicking on this button right here so you have your analytics over here and if you click on the analytics button over here you can choose whichever one you want so over here you will see all of your analytics you will see the total posts total audience and total impressions as well so as you can see over here we have 16 followers on twitter five on our instagram page and zero on our facebook page so we can see all of them and see what we're doing wrong and right and all of that so pretty simple then we have our engagement over here at the top as you can see this is going to be our engagement we can see all of the engagement on our posts on our stories whatnot and we can see how many likes we get how many comments we get and all of that so it's pretty simple and then we have the start page option where we can build our page our landing page where we can connect all of our social media accounts so as you can see this is how it looks like as you can see it's pretty simple i created this so we can go ahead and edit it out so if you click on the profile image over here you can go ahead and edit out the profile image you can change the your profile image you can add like an alternative text you can add your business or profile name your some personal words and you can add header format with or without the banner so with the banner the, without the banner this is how it's going to look like and this is another banner style as well with the banner this is how it's going to look like and this is another banner style i think this one looks pretty good we can go with that and then you can choose some images at the bottom when over here or you can browse your own gifts by clicking on this button and you can browse some giphys as well so if you click over here it's going to open up giphy and we can download some gifts and then we can upload them over there as well but for now i think this looks good let's go ahead and change it to maybe like this like the black background with sparkling lights over here i think that will look good let's see if it works there we go as you can see that looks much better and yeah then you can go back and then you can click on these buttons over here you can click on individual buttons and you can add different links and you can add like a label on them to know what they are whether they're podcasts stores or blogs whatever and then you have your social links at the bottom you can add different social links twitter your youtube your instagram all you got to do is just go over to your facebook profile or instagram profile and then copy that profile link and then paste them over here and you should be good to go you can add different social links over here by clicking on the add social link icon and you can add your instagram facebook whatsapp linkedin youtube discord whatever you want it's pretty simple then you have your appearances over here on the right side as well you can change the background you can go with a white background with a yellow color a purple background with purples pink green blue or black one i like the black one and i want to change it to red so let's go ahead and change it to perfect red over here as you can see and we're going to go with a bright red color yeah that looks much better as you can see over here yeah that looks cool then you can change the fonts as well so you have railway you have montserrat whatever you want so railway looks good it hasn't changed as of yet but uh yeah pretty much that's it you can click on the show more button to show more options but yeah pretty much generally that's it then you just simply have to publish the changes and then you can add your business name over here and then you can click on start name so jimmy's dot start page and then you just simply click on the publish icon and it's going to publish this page and then you can copy this link and you can open up instagram settings or tiktok or twitter whatever you want and you can paste these links within their profile you know in the bio so that whenever someone clicks on them they're going to be arrived over here onto a page similar to this with all of your links and social medias and you know images as well so that's how you use it so pretty much that's it that's how you use uh, buffer to grow your instagram or twitter or whatever type of uh, social media you use to grow audience so that is it for this video guys hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have any questions let me know in the comment sections down below and i'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible so having said that i'll catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye